Welcome back, I'm Captain Xavier, and I'm joined by my friend Luchithor. And uh, he has brought something that is the, the most magnificent crossover between my two channels that one could possibly imagine. He has brought a Lego-style blaster, which is just neat. And uh, when he was talking about it in our group chat, he mentioned that he was going to try to put afterburner an afterburner on it. And I pointed out that I have all of the parts necessary to build an afterburner out of Lego, using nothing but Lego parts. So we're going to do that. First, we're going to build it. We're going to see how it works. And then we are going to put an afterburner on this thing somehow. It's bolt action. It does fire darts. I don't believe it actually has a plunger tube. I think it just uses rubber bands or springs or something. Well, let's get this thing apart and do this. Where's my ridge knife? <laughs> I'm a shanky. <laughs> So I said five feet. You can shoot it. Because you built it. What's nice is both of those pieces, one comes up to catch the thing, and the other one holds the dart in place. <laughs> yeah. So that at least a lot of that. But all right, I said five feet, so. What in the thing? Uh I think you won. Barely over well, five. No, no. Let's okay. let's let's do this right. Oh. Open the garage door. Oh yeah. Grab the measuring tape. Let's get the FPS of this bad boy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited now. It might work. All right. Well, it shoots. It came in at uh, around <laughs> between 16 and 22 feet. It was going too slow for the chronograph to even pick it up. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and take this into my uh, Lego workshop, and we're going to look into putting in some kind of an afterburner. It ain't going to be pretty, but we can make it work. That is entirely too fun. <laughs> it actually is a very smooth action. Yeah. It could use a little bit more reinforcement back here, but mm, like it works. It does have a trigger reset. And, uh, yeah. You could probably put a heavier rubber band or double up the rubber band and get a little bit more power out of it. I don't know if it would support... They give you plenty. And they give you extra pegs. All right. Let's go afterburner this thing. Yes. Put your thorn. What do you think of it? Uh, it's attractive. Isn't it, though? We have succeeded in building afterburners. Yup. We have a pair of Lego motors. Of the old high RPM ones. A pair of wheels. A pair of battery boxes. You push them both down. And they spin the correct direction. And when loaded. It will in fact fire it. I don't know that it fires it any faster than it used to. But that is not the point. The point is we built an afterburner entirely using Lego product. There are no non-Lego parts other than, I suppose, the batteries, but um, all of it Lego. And not even a lot of Lego. It was actually fairly simple to... 
get the mouse. We went through several different wheels before we found one that allowed us to better center it. Um, and it is, in fact, entirely removable. That is stock. And that's all it takes to connect it. This just connects here. Front post connects there. Battery housing connects to the bottom. And the gift. Yep. So there we have it. We have successfully put an afterburner on this atrocious thing. It probably, <laughs> it might get 25 feet now. Maybe. Maybe. That's a maybe. That's a maybe. But it does work, which is ridiculous and fantastic. I have no doubt that Luchathor will attempt to improve this in some manner. We got so many extra rubber bands. You could probably try doubling it and see if that does anything. Just shoot the heads off darts. Like, literally yeah. the heads. Just, no one's using those. <laughs> <laughs> just load a buckshot. <laughs> Dart has just come flying out. Oh, uh, yeah. I like it. I think it's silly and fantastic. And the, uh, the afterburner is an absolute must. So there you have it. An afterburnered, rubber band powered, dart flinging, Lego like monstrosity. I think it's pretty cool. Yeah. I like it. <laughs> Hopefully, next year, when the wars start up again, Luchathor will run this or have Brett run it. I'm sure Brett will destroy us all with this thing. Yeah. Uh, and we will pull the afterburner back out and get it strapped back on, and it will be lovely! Thank you for watching. Run for it!